Sue, we are still rocking the CSAs. Yes. We are chatting away now with uh, the doc was what Walla Walla. Mm -hmm. Give me your rundown. It's about a Palestinian girl, and I started shooting her when she was 16 and followed her until she was 23. In it's quite a roller coaster of a story, but the basics are that she's struggling to become uh, one of the few police women on the Palestinian security forces. And this is somebody who's uh, a bit of a rule breaker. She's not used to discipline. She's a bit of a wild child. Yet she really wants the uniform. She wants the independence and the bank accounts. So it's sort of it's a, your kind of classic coming of age story. It turns into a bit of a boot camp film. But all in the context of a very volatile place where she lives and her background and where she comes from is really kind of, uh, she lives in the Balata refugee camp in the West Bank so it sort of follows her trying to chart a very different path for herself and uh, yeah, it's not boring. No. For sure. <laughs> now, you said what, 16 to 23 you're following yeah. around. Now did you like just check in like a couple months a year? Were you there like for the entire run? I mean, and more importantly, how do you get to stay in a location like that for that amount of time? Mostly I shot there one to two weeks, once a year. Uh, when she gets into boot camp, I shot there four times in, a, in four months, so it was a little bit more compressed. But the story kind of arcs in a way that's pretty dramatic, and I think that's partly to do with the time, the amount of time that, that we spent. Uh, but yeah, I wasn't there continuously. I just popped back and forth whenever it felt like the next major movement in her story was about to happen. Awesome. And I'm getting the wrap-up signal. I'm getting really good at paying attention to that now. But before you go, we always have a fun little selfie. Everybody. That is awesome. That sounds okay. amazing. Thanks for the opportunity to talk about the film. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, my God.